Ladies and gentlemen, this match is set for the title of India's best electric scooter. In the grey corner, we have the sleek, the stylish, the sporty, the Aether 450X. And in the fiery red corner, it aims to be India's new people's champion, the Ola S1 Pro. Piloting these two vehicles will be our new and young road testers. Hey, hangman, rooster, come quickly. Come quickly. Gentlemen, welcome. Now, which one are you guys picking? I'm Aether. picking the Aether. Oh, no. How can both of you ride the Aether? I know. Rock, paper, scissors. So, best of three? Rock, paper, scissors. Oh. One nil. Rock, paper, scissors. No. One all. Rock, paper, scissors. Yes! So guys, now that you've chosen your vehicles, let's start with our test. And the first test is the drag test. Even though the Ola doesn't get off the line rapidly, the S1 just steamrolls past the 450X with ease. It is in fact 4.5 seconds quicker to the 80 km per hour mark in our V-Box test. So, I had nothing to worry about. So, I think that was predictable, right? But uh, now the Ola also has Eco mode. Yeah? yeah? And you also have Eco mode. So, let's do the same drag in Eco mode. Huh, I didn't expect this. I guess it could be down to my higher top speed in eco mode, plus the fact that the S1 struggles to get to respectable speeds quickly. And even then, it can only muster 36 kmph on the V-Box. So guys, electric scooters, people have this range anxiety fear. So uh, when you guys did range testing in the city a couple of days ago, how much did you achieve and in which mode? 91 in eco. <laughs> 91? I did 136 in eco mode. Bro, you're basically a hazard on the road. You were that slow. Okay, so in eco mode, the initial response is dull. So that left me with two choices. Either to switch to normal mode, get the speed and switch back to eco mode, or be the daredevil and chug along all time. So basically what you're trying to say is, Eco mode was not convenient and yeah. you'll have to do yeah, the full run of. again in normal then? Baga, I knew you'd say that and I've already finished the run in normal mode. And oh, guess really? what? I achieved 140 kilometers. 140? What? You got more range in normal mode than in eco? Yeah. How is that possible? Like I said, it was easier to manage city speeds in normal mode. So I was a lot safer and more controlled when I was in normal mode. Simple. Makes no sense. But clearly, point to Ola. Having a smaller battery means a full charge is faster on the 450X. You can save almost an hour in the process. Plus, at the time of recording this video, Aether has set up quite a few fast chargers in Pune and in other cities as well. Ola, on the other hand, its website shows fast charging stations across locations, but we are yet to see one in action. So as of today, it is two points to the Aether. So, smart guys on smart electric scooters. Next test is how quickly can you connect your smartphones to your smart scooters? Whoever is the fastest wins the test. Okay. So why are we waiting? Connect, connect. OTP. OTP. Why? OTP is done. It's done. done. It's done. All right. Okay. Wait, wait. I'll just come. Ooh. The pretty neat interface. Yep. Good. Okay. Itna time thi laga. I had to connect my phone twice, man. Twice. For what? For this.
गाइस तुम लोग ने बहुत मस्ती कर लिया कैमरा गाइस आप गेटिंग टायर्ड यार नीरज निखिल यू गाइस वांट आइसक्रीम्स ओके गेट टू मेक्सोरी ओरियोज ईच ओके पुट इट ऑन योर नेविगेशन सिस्टम गेट इट द लूजर ऑफ दिस टेस्ट इज जिसका भी आइसक्रीम ज्यादा पिघला होगा ओके सो गो क्विकली चलो who's going to connect first who's going to connect first oh it's same looks looks quite same whoever is ready <laughs> he's struggling with his gloves both of them are ready oh and it's, it's neck and jab tak ye log ja rahe hai camera rakh do na tum log idhar aa jao tum log idhar aa jao camera rakh do ha wide 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 kar de rakh de rakh de who do you think will come first ether or dordi wala ether ether ola na ether ether if he's going on hyper ola आइसक्रीम मिलेगा कि मिल्कशेक मिलेगा अरे अरे इधर आ गए 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 जल 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 कैमरा ले लो कैमरा ले लो कैमरा ले लो ओके ओके लेट सी द स्टेट ऑफ द मिक्स दरी और पिघला है क्या पिघला है क्या देखते हैं पिघला है क्या नॉट क्वाइट मिल्क शेक स्टिल इंटैक्ट सो या ओहो ब्रो लेट्स इंस्पेक्ट योर योर्स इज ऑल्सो इंटैक्ट बोथ आर प्रेटी सेम बट ही केम फर्स्ट सो ही वन सो बॉइस नेक्स्ट वील डू द स्टैंडर्ड सेट ऑफ कन्वीनियंस एंड प्रैक्टिकलिटी फीचर्स थ्री ऑफ दैम The first one is what I introduced last time around. This small hill climb test. Okay. In normal mode, okay. No cheating. So, yeah, right. Yeah. My DOP friend will let me know if you've cheated or not. Okay. Fine. Cool. Quickest one to the top wins this test. Three, two, one, go. The lack of initial pep hurts the S1 Pro here again. it struggled massively in normal mode and even in hyper it was slower than the 450x in ride whereas the 450x in walk did this so guys next up is the rough road test your electric scooters will some day or the other have to deal with the real india okay so let's check how comfortable they are over broken surfaces and i've already got things planned can you just uh, get up open the boot this car pani colors yeah two up again chalo There's nothing to choose between these two electric scooters when it comes to ride comfort. Both spill the same amount of water and hence we have to call it a tie. The Aether's floor is deceivingly spacious, fitting the suitcase quite comfortably. Thanks to the central spine and the curvature of the floor, carrying the same luggage on the S1 becomes quite tricky. So point here to the Aether. Lastly there's no need to bring potatoes here the humongous underseat storage space of the S1 easily wins it the point in the storage test Again at the time of recording this video the Ola is 13000 cheaper than the Aether in Pune and this includes the state subsidies so i guess that's another point for the Ola S1 Pro So boys and the viewers We compared these two scooters on 13 aspects and out of them it was a tie on one of them. Okay? Ride quality both of them were on par. Okay? The winner of this test 7 to 
is the ether. Are you surprised that the Ola hasn't won it? Uh, to an extent, yeah. But while I'm impressed with the performance, the features, as well as the boot storage, I know this scooter lacks certain things. Like? For starters, there are so many software glitches. Even though they yeah. have moved it to Move OS 2.0. Yeah. The screen froze a couple of times. Yeah. The navigation, we were lucky that it managed to find McDonald's, but during my <laughs> test runs, yes. okay. <laughs> there were some issues. The company has been promising that they are uh, they are available Pan India, yeah. but as far as we know, so they they just need to let their customers know, be more be more active with their communication. That's what you're trying to say. Yeah, be yeah. more tra be more transparent. Correct, correct. Okay, so so the issue here with the scooter is not is not the hardware. It's more the software. It was something which the company can fix. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So OTA updates and stuff. Plus, it's got more range, right? That that you can't that you can't forget. Mr. Ether, happy? Very happy. Yeah. See, the thing is, I agree. Okay. So the Ola is sold across the country. Correct. You do not get the Ether. Yeah. In it, major limited city. reach. Yeah. But that's not a problem really. Wherever they are, yeah. they've ensured that whoever rides an Ether gets a complete product. It feels natural to ride this scooter, almost yeah. like a regular scooter. Yeah. It has the same list of features. I have a decent boot space. Okay, it's not as no big as that. No cruise control. Okay, yeah, I lack a few features and I lack a little bit of range and a bit of performance too, but those are things that we can actually get in the future from Aether, you know? What we have right now is a very effortless scooter. And it feels like a properly built product yeah. Yeah. right now there are no issues as such which you are facing it's seamless yeah man so navigation work well, yeah right so currently as it is this still holds a great promise yeah. it is a good scooter a good peppy scooter but at the end of the day the, looking at the entire package and yeah. what is still perhaps mm. the best electric scooter that is there in the country has to it has to be the Aether yeah. So that's our verdict guys, do let us know which one of these two scooters is your preferred pick. Don't forget to like and share this video, follow Ishan, follow Manal on their Instagram IDs because they are going to be doing a lot more videos out here on Zigwheels and boys, where are you guys taking me for some grub? Oh, I, I've got to go Winner's Winner seat, right? <laughs>